This is Catholic Daily Reflections for the 5th Sunday of Easter, Year A. Today's reflection is entitled, The Only Way to Salvation. I am the way and the truth and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. Are you saved? Hopefully, the answer to this is yes in three ways. You were saved by grace through baptism. You continue to be saved by God's grace and mercy as you freely choose to follow Him. And you hope to be saved in your final hour so as to enter into the glories of heaven. Anything we accomplish in life means nothing if we cannot answer yes in this threefold way. It's also important to be reminded of how we are saved. How is it that we were, are, and hope to receive this precious gift of salvation? The answer is simple. Through the life, death, and resurrection of Jesus Christ, our one and only way to the Father. There is no other way to obtain salvation than through Him. Sometimes we can fall into the trap of thinking that we achieve salvation by simply being good. In other words, do your good works save you? The proper answer is both yes and no. It's yes only in the sense that our good works are a necessary part of union with Christ. Without Him, we can do nothing good. But if we have accepted Christ into our life and thus, if we are on the road to salvation, then good works will be necessarily present in our life. But the answer is also no in the sense that Jesus and Jesus alone is the only Savior. We cannot save ourselves no matter how hard we try to be good. This discussion is especially familiar among our evangelical Christian brothers and sisters, but it's a conversation we should be quite familiar with also. At the heart of this conversation is the person of Jesus Christ. He and He alone must be the central focus of our lives and we must see Him as the way, the truth, and the life. He is the only way to heaven. He is the fullness of the truth we must believe, and He is the life that we are called to live and is the source of this new life of grace. Reflect today upon the central and singular role of Jesus in your life. Without Him, you are nothing, but with Him, you obtain the life of perfect fulfillment. Choose Him in a very personal and concrete way this day as your Lord and Savior. Humbly admit that you are nothing without Him. And let Him into your life so that He can offer you to His loving Father in heaven. Let us pray. My Lord and my Savior, I say yes to you this day and accept you into my life as my Lord and Savior. I thank you for the gift of baptism which began my life of grace, and I renew my choice to follow you this day so that you may enter more fully into my life. As you enter into my life, please offer me to the Father in heaven May all my actions be directed by you so that I may be an eternal offering with you, dear Jesus. Jesus, I trust in you.